So we're just taking what we want. Because we can. And no one can stop us. Is our dude overseeing construction? Yes, he is. Very good. You oversee construction. Don't you dare do anything else. You're working on threat decay? Good. After my most recent victory, I have reunited my most trusted commanders to discuss our future military campaigns. Through my skill and dedication, I have earned the loyalty of armies and immortalized my name as one of the great conquerors of our time. One who emerged triumphant from countless battles. Okay. We will be known as the Bloodhound, but we will become the founder of a bloodline. So, leading the center gives us plus 5%, levy reinforcement raise plus 5%, increase the chance of finding artifacts after sieging enemy holdings. That's not bad. Make a speech about studying, so we could become a warrior philosopher. Oh, wow. Okay, this is really cool. So, standard, I think we did the 15 out of 15. Yeah, the foreign war was the rebellion just now. So standard is this option, this is what you always get, but due to us having, well it's not really high, but it's high enough apparently, having this, we could go for movement speed, plus 15%, and retreat plus 5%, and plus 3 combat skill, and we could use drill the troops. I don't know what that means. <laughs> I really don't. Um, I'm not going to go for it, but the warrior philosopher is pretty damn cool. We will go for this one. Or will we? <laughs> like movement speed. Especially for for us. So every one of our bloodline would have a plus 15% movement speed. Which is really important with the vast distances we are covering. That's <laughs> quite juicy. So we're going to go for this. We, we will be the warrior philosopher and found our bloodline on learning rather than just pure bloodlust. Which, again, quite historically accurate. So, yeah. Let's figure out what drilled troops will do to us. The philosophy of war. By emulating some of the greatest and wisest kings of old, we have achieved the perfect balance between wisdom and grit, becoming both a scholar and a warrior, and applying a vast, the vast depth of our knowledge to lead our armies to countless victories and earn eternal glory for our dynasty. Few people can claim to have accomplished as much as we within our lifetime, excelling both in spiritual and political disciplines such, uh, to such an extent. Our name will surely be remembered in many legends by future generations, as that of a respected and fearsome warrior philosopher. Clarity of mind and firmness of intent. Oh, I love this. This is amazing. Okay, now let's talk a little bit about bloodlines because they're quite new and I didn't know all that much about them either. Um, so here over here is clear all the things that you get from it. And here it says how you can transfer it and if it's active or not. So this one will be given out by both our women and our men. So we'll always have this in our bloodline. This is really cool. We could try to get more bloodlines into our own by looking for matches of strong bloodlines. Um, but we'll have to make sure that it's a matrilineal transfer if we want to transfer like this. It, ideally we get both because otherwise the heirs of our heirs of our heirs might slip out of them basically but this is already really cool the movement speed of 15% is really really good um, should we go for military supply or siege equipment hmm. I think military supply is good we can certainly use more retinue space, so we can even more crazy amounts of troops under our banner. How much money do we earn these days? Enough. So we can have some more highly expensive troops. 
Oh, would you look at that? There's a new option. Or I never really scrolled down far enough. We can have 250 heavy cavalry for 250 gold, which will cost us 0 0.35 monthly. But it will jump up once they get into battle. Are they even really good? Because they have a good attack modifier, but a defense negative modifier. Let's get some of these. Like 500 of these. Sounds really good to me. Now something about pillaging I forgot is you can only merge pillaging armies with pillaging armies. So... Also turn pillaging off if you go into a conventional war. Because that's not going to work well in your favor. They can see how much these troops cost us in, um, in resupplying. Just them. Crazy amounts of money. Which doesn't show up here, but shows up over here. Which confuses me a little bit. Why doesn't it show up here? Show up here. Board upkeep. That's... All just the heavy cavalry is 11. 32 per month. <laughs> I guess they're not full right now. Once they're done... That should go up. Or rather down. Ooh. All these people can be ransomed. Well, let's do it. Let's ransom some people. These we get from sieges. You don't really see it, but... Because there's not... I think there might be messages up here, but I always ignore those, so... A steward. He's really good. And we have a loyal counselor as it is, so let's have someone who's just really good at... Being a steward, doing the steward thing, huh? Sounds good. And oversee construction of our stuff. Ooh, special minor titles, let's see. Shad. Are there any of my sons? Yeah. Give it to him. Are there more of our sons? Really should know the name of our son by now. Kappa. Okay, let's give it to some of these because they kind of hate us. Improving their opinion of us. Uh, our advisor. No. Could be our second son. Yeah. Let's have him be commander. I mean, probably better ones. Why not use our kids? And where are 250 heavy there? Let's have him lead those directly and him lead those directly. I'm not entirely sure how useful commanders on this lower level are. But, you know, might just well just use what you got. This army is growing, is it? Why do I have these troops? Event spawned. There's just some weird event spawned troops. Speaking of troops, he's raising some. I think he might want to push us away and get us to go away. But that's not how this works. I'm here. I'm here to stay. Okay, our troops are fully replenished, so we have monthly expenses of minus two. That's a lot. For an army that's not reinforcing, that's a lot of money. Quite a lot of money. But we should go up to 7,000, so... Let's spend even more money by getting a few more horse archers, putting us over 3,000 with those. I mean, 
We can pay our whole army. And that's really amazing. We can pay our whole army in peacetime. Just from the effects of this book. This is amazing. Really great. Okay, apparently he's fighting against some other invader. Oh, I say invader, but they're really just, you know, playing around. I am an invader. Oh no. Prepared invasion of Greece. Okay. Be part of the Byzantine Revolt War. Oh yeah. I'll help. So you're facing a rebellion, are you? Okay. I'll give you these and my sons as leaders for your war. How does that sound? That's their capital, I believe. But they got a lot of troops there. Oh, over here is 10,000. Let's find some more troops to add to this. But yeah. Let's combine a tome and squash that pesky little rebellion facing our dear vassal. Well, tributary, not vassal. Everyone is leading armies, goody goody. We are experiencing a victories upon victories. Now we're just... I've encountered him many times while carrying out my duties for the Eagle Warriors and it was always pleasant. An occasion we can talk for hours. Yeah, this is... Let's be friends. Friends in this game are always good. They got your back. They help you when you need it most. Duel for honor. Sure. But we are at war, so we cannot duel. For any reason whatsoever. No dueling allowed. Right, let's take care of this rebel army. And we're going to give them our flank leader. Is there a way to get here without a river cross, I think? Yes. We'll go here and then here. And I don't know exactly where he's going. Here? Definitely here, but where else is going? There? Um, oh, it's a stupid little dance, but we'll get them. Let's check on the composition. Light infantry and heavy infantry mostly. And the same is on our side. Though we have more light infantry than heavy. This might not work out in our favor. But we have a whole lot more archers. But they have a whole lot more light cavalry. I'm not so confident in this one. At least with the negative modifier. Plus 100%. Yeah, I know. We're not going to fight that one. We'll find them somewhere a little bit better. Oh no. My horse bit my son. Well, don't get in front of my horse then. Oi. Seriously. Okay, they're still in the mountains. 
So we're going to siege here in hopes of them attacking us across the river into the mountains. We're losing some troops due to attrition. It's winter and it's not the best terrain to be in. But I hope it'll be fine. Severity of the county increases slightly. Good. Oh, what? As my men return from looting the holding, one of them hands me an axe with a strange purple sheen and a plus etched into the handle, followed by the number of two. <laughs> After weighing it carefully. Okay, we get the plus two axe. And we feel stronger. Yes. Of course, a little head nod toward uh, RPGs. It's a it's a purple axe. It's epic workmanship. Well, that's fine and fun. So we're losing troops to attrition quite a bit, but not much more. Still trying to bait him into attacking us because we might win this one. Uh, he's not taking the bait, so we lost all our troops to attrition for no reason whatsoever. Well done, us. Well done, indeed. I oh, know we have lost the commander. Oh, it's one of the plus twenty, or the twenty plus. Light infantry leader. Let's make it a family business. Feeding troops. There's just no good way to fight these. This is all mountainous. Maybe we can go help him over here against this army. Looks like he's fighting two things at a time anyway. Are we done? We're done. So now, we're not going to... Ah, oh, these are two counties, so we can go here first. If I had my horde down here, I would 100% just attack even into mountains, because cavalry is so much stronger than anything they might be able to field. But I'm not trusting it. Try to join him here, hopefully in time to save his battle. Because it's not looking good. It's not a good choice of his. Well, the defenders are breaking. There we go. Reinforce just in time. All right, and now we're going to attach to their army so they can do whatever they want with the larger troops and I don't have to worry about it anymore we are fulfilling our obligation helping good Ooh, we can rank up to hero okay what does hero give us we are going to rank up Lose 2,000 renown, that's fine. <laughs> okay, apparently we had to duel uh, the current hero for the job. And with our plus two axe, we totally won this one. And... We'll let him live, of course. So now we are the hero, I think. Yes, we are. So what does it give us? While leading armies, you no longer suffer lethal injuries from the battles. Wow. That is crazy good. You're immune to dying as a commander. Are you quite serious? Right-clicking your own character portrait temporarily unlock a special battle action tactics for your character and receive reinforcement troops from your warrior lodge 
as long as we're leading troops. The troops will depend on the society we are part of. Once peace is established, the regiments will take their leave. Choose three different military specializations. Oh, we could drill troops. What does that do? We should do it. Uh, military aspect we can't do yet. But let's drill our troops. Spend prestige to boost your command skills. Okay. Okay. Oh. Polished formation. For how many days? Four years. So minus 10 attrition for us for four years. Oh, we get polished formation. I'm not sure what that does, but I think just popped here. Oh, 10% movement speed. Yes, hello. Thank you. I will take that gladly. Sounds awfully fun. Good, so he can now do whatever he wants with these troops and fight. And hopefully win his own war while we just help around the house. <laughs> yeah, sure. Let's have all the marriages. Oh, yes. Our quick son has become a gray eminence, which is the highest one for diplomacy. And everyone is an homosexual. Come on. He will become a mercenary. For us. Let's see. Maybe he will, through his deeds, outdo all these other sons of ours. Can we give you a concubine? Do we have a good concubine to give? Not really. Nothing good. He'll figure it out. We don't need to send him sexual partners. I'm, I'm sure he'll, he'll get it done in time. On his very own. Why are people still joining our defensive pact, huh? It's going down. We're becoming less and less of a threat. My marshal has been using my soldiers to extort money. Oh, come on, man. Why you gotta do this? We'll put one of our sons in here. Or... Not one of our clans. Never one of our clans. Not ever. This guy. Let's make it this guy. And we want more manpower because all the raiding got us thirsty for more men. I'm just moving around here so I don't cross a river attacking into this. Sometimes you can see on the map where it, there's no river crossing. Sometimes you have to look at this. But this will be a fun little battle. Can we have anyone helping us? Oh yeah, our second son. Or third son? Is our third son. There are more sons around without wives. Let's do this. Look at that. No contest. We have lost six and they have lost everything. How unfortunate. Find you someone. That's pretty slim pickings these days. Have you this? Why oh, he's a cavalry leader? Not even half banned. Oh, he's not that great, though. 
everything is going well. There's not really anything that can threaten us. I mean, the most problematic thing going on currently in our realm is our tributary being attacked. Oh, would you look at that? Duke Frodi the Conqueror was captured in battle and is now my prisoner. Well, I would say if we go ahead and sacrifice the leader of this invasion, that would help, wouldn't it? Goodbye, leader of this. Oh, damn. I lowered the war score by killing the leader. It didn't do what I thought it might do. Oops. Yeah, don't mind me messing up your wars. I'm, um... Uh, that was, uh, yeah. Highly intentional. Uh, there was no error in judgment. That was exactly what I was going to do. Um, nothing ever happened. Just forget the whole thing. Ah, look at this. Our sons are nowhere to be seen, leading army. I don't care. We should probably go check the factions soon. But that might be another day, if I do remember by then. 